We are trying to find the value of m plus n, and they're both integers. That means they're not fractions. They're positive and negative whole numbers. So let's look at clue one. I'm going to multiply the left-hand side. x times x is x squared. x times n is nx. m times x is mx plus m times n is mn. And we know that equals x squared plus 5x plus mn. Now, notice how there's three terms on the right. I want to rewrite the, right, the left-hand side in three terms if I can. And if you notice, there's an x common in both of those. So let's factor that x out, and that would leave me n plus m times x plus mn equals x squared plus 5x plus mn. So this term here is the term that has the x on it, and so we know the coefficient is 5. The coefficient here is n plus m, so n plus m equals 5, and that answers the question. Now, we do not know the individual values of n and m, but it doesn't matter. It doesn't ask for that. We just want to figure out what is the sum of m plus n. So clue one works independently. M and e, this bottom one does not work because that could be two times two gives you four, or it could be negative two times negative two, or four times one, whatever. Uh, <clears throat> so that one doesn't work. So your answer would be A.